Hi, and welcome to a Real Estate Minute brought to you by KB Home with a quick view of some opportunities you can read about in the Denver Post this weekend. I'm Mark Samuelson, and you'll find stories about an age 55 plus community that's selling like hotcakes inside the city of Denver, about a low maintenance community in Broomfield that has only 12 homes left to sell, and about how Denver is in a minority of U.S. markets where homes have recovered all of the value that they lost in the 2009 downturn. That latter story by veteran Denver Post business writer Aldo Spaldi says 99% of homes in the metro Denver area have now regained or surpassed the peak prices they held before the 2009 national real estate downturn, according to new data from Trulia. But only a third of homes nationwide have reached that mark. Trulia's report, titled The Housing Recovery That Wasn't, puts Denver's post-recession performance among the best of 100 U.S. housing markets. Denver's surrounding counties are also showing a strong recovery, but that's less true on Colorado's western slope, where Spaldi says median prices in many areas are still below their old highs. Those prices in Metro Denver are way beyond their highs from a decade ago, up 50.5% from their pre-recession high of $237,071. That's the highest gain of any of 100 metro areas studied. Colorado Springs, a little slower to recover, is also showing some of the best recovery rates in the nation now. You can read more about that at denverpost.com. One of the fastest rising stars in the metro area has been the city and county of Broomfield, with a near perfect commuter location between Denver and Boulder, and of course, housing prices that have risen rapidly along with the city's fortunes. That's created quick sales for a neighborhood of reasonably priced paired homes that KB Home has created off Sheridan Parkway just east of Anthem in a part of the city where new infrastructure adds much to Broomfield's allure. Randy Carpenter, division president at KB Home Colorado, says buyers at KB Home's North Park are always telling his sales reps that they're tired of being outbid on resale homes in the area. In that climate, KB Home's villa paired homes have disappeared fast now down to a final dozen homes, including one ready for move-in now and a number of others that are headed for completion this summer. Prices on those final 12 homes start in the low 400s, real prices that reflect designer features on homes set for early delivery. On all of those, buyers get front yard landscape maintenance and snow removal for only $125 a month. Each home has a private side yard for an owner's personal use, a garden or a big patio or barbecue, or outdoor space for a pet. Carpenter says the low maintenance aspects have proved as popular as the location for North Park's buyers. Some of them older wanting to downsize, some younger looking for affordability and more time for enjoying outdoor entertainment. That could work either way for a three bedroom plus loft plan that KB Home has ready for move in right now at North Park. 1,682 square feet of finished space, including two and a half baths, a bright open kitchen with quartz countertops that opens to a family room with fireplace, plus two car attached garage and a 650 square foot basement. It's priced at $424,000. North Park is 10 minutes up Sheridan from Central Broomfield, just south of Highway 7 Baseline Road with a King Supers Marketplace already open two blocks north and a proposed University of Colorado Health Campus planned just east. Numbers of North Park buyers are in health-related careers, while others take advantage of the location to commute to DIA 25 minutes east. To visit, take I-25 North past E-470 to exit 229 Highway 7 and turn west 1.3 miles to Sheridan Parkway, then south to Preble Creek. Or visit kbhome.com. I'm Mark Samuelson. You can see this and all of my stories at denverpost.com.